Well, we're gonna we're gonna start doing hardcore because... weeb stuff. Hardcore weeb fiction. Hey guys, I... it's me, the Audible Blink. We're gonna read something called Blood Raining Night by Recheru Ketsuekinoku Oni, which is not a Japanese word at all. Reicheru Ketsuekinoku Oni is a 17 year old cat demon girl who has tore cured by the memory of her father. She works for Yakuza with her dog cat demon friend Inuyasha, which is the name of an anime. She loves Denmark, but her love is put into peril. <laughs> Who's challenging the authority of Denmark? <laughs> England. <laughs> <laughs> we heard you're hiding Hamlet. <laughs> <laughs> Will she save her relationship and destroy her father? Find out. I plan to. Chapter one, the first rainy night. The sky was blue out. <laughs> <laughs> sure wasn't blue in and as well. Right, right, Ray, Ray had just opened her golden eyes to the morning, like she has for the past seventeen years of her life. She groggily rubbed her hands on her eyelids and rolled over. She was staring Denmark in the face. <laughs> Or she kills him. Den but <laughs> it's the country of Denmark. Like, what is this? <laughs> it is like my name. Yeah, but what? Danny Kun. <laughs> We're reading fan fiction. Come here. Yeah. Is she supposed to be part of this? Like floating butterflies and breeze. Good morning. I missed you in my sleep. <laughs> Yet no, it's my turn. Yet <clears throat> I've Took missed. His no. <laughs> <laughs> I've missed you too. He took his hand and ran it down to the tip of her soft, furry Please. ear. <laughs> her ear twitched with delight. I get worried about you sometimes, though. Really? Her golden <laughs> eyeballs <laughs> like a light in a lamp. Good metaphor. I'm going to hang myself. Yes, of course. You work for the Yakuza. How <laughs> Yakuza? else am I supposed to feel? <laughs> the Japanese mafia? Yeah, the Japanese mafia. Oh my God. Her eyes gazed downwards as if trying to see something on the floor. It's good to know there's actually someone who cares about my existence. I love you with all my heart, Raycoon. No! <laughs> you know, I know, you do. I know you do. I love you, Denny Coon. Ray Cheru purred. They kissed passionately like a woman and men that haven't seen each other for 40 years but have loved each other all that time. That's oddly specific. That's a really good metaphor. It almost reminds me of as tall as a six foot two tree. Right, <laughs> She wanted to drink his blood. Oh. Uh. Really, really bad. But she couldn't, for if she were to suck the life juices out of him, it would turn him into a demon vampire. Why is that bad? Well... <laughs> Oh, of course, goodness. she would never let anything bad happen to him. He was the love of her life and her only love. This is not bad. Okay, so na no, 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 no. Ne next, we're gonna get into the number one best bad fan fiction thing to do in bad fan fiction: devote a whole paragraph to describing how your character looks. And I want to read it. No, yes. you already read the I don't always read. know the character's and a then, girl, so she looks like a girl. Yeah, but it's a girl with cat ears and also demon vampire. I'm out. We have to know now. Right to you. At least no, like, no, let no, me no. say right to you. Fine. Right to you. Dressed in her outfit she wore to the Yakuza. Yakuza. You don't go to the Yakuza like you go to a job. They're the mafia. Hey, I hey, go hey, to secret okay. Yakuza hideout. You do 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 do. I wear a nice suit for the Yakuza. She, she wore to the Yakuza and got ready for work. She wore a white schoolgirl's outfit that had long sleeves, a red ribbon around her neck, red trimming that went on her sleeves, a red skirt, her brown hair tied up in a red ribbon, red as blood, and a big gun. <laughs> Little red she riding hood. She for the Yakuza. Uh, the red. A professional red. A professional red. Okay. Her long brown hair with blue highlights in the middle swayed in the breeze so beautifully she could almost kill someone with her lips were really red. But she didn't need expected she would have had a tough assignment today. Raicheru was hanging out. What? Raicheru was out. She was out? She was out. Oh my. She was killed. 
She like Yay! pulled her pants. She was she pulled her pants down and she was out, <laughs> prowling in the woods. When she heard a certain cackling, it was a witch. Uh, the witch said in a nasty voice, <laughs> like you're eating something slimy. I've seen this girl out to get me, and she thinks she's prettier than me. The witch. <laughs> No, I, get, I have to read this one, too, because well, this is amazing. Witch, of course she's prettier than her. The witch was Bill Cosby. Oh, how I'm going to oh, rub God. my tear. Well, Rachel, Rachel smiled. Rachel. You are old and ugly, and I'm assigned to kill you. Oh. This will be the last time you fight me. I reckon I'm fixing to kill <laughs> you. Isn't this the first time mm, that she fought I reckon her? I'm fixing to kill you. Mm, mm. <laughs> this will be the last time you fight me! Rachel ran towards the hag, her breasts delicately bouncing in the wind. <laughs> <laughs> Delicately. In the Delicately. wind? <laughs> the wind is like. Oh my god. Wear a sports bra. <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. This shouldn't be happening regardless. <laughs> Why are we talking about her breasts? I don't know. She's 12. She's attacking okay, a witch. No. I'm Why? lying. She's 17. That's Why, still a no. Like, have breasts. <laughs> yeah. But, but all of us do. Equality. We, well, no, just no. Than yours. The witch <laughs> took out a staff and tried to smite her, but fell short when Rachel <laughs> suddenly disappeared and reappeared behind her. I told you not to mess with me, she said, slitting the witch Ches throat open. She put her lips to the wrinkly neck and sucked on it really, really hard. Oh. The blood came pouring into her oh, mouth like God. a waterfall of gore and violence. She was going home after having killed the witch when she heard an unusual noise coming from the bushes. He said, I've come back for you. Rachel, you. Was astonished. <laughs> Father, she yelped, you're supposed to be dead. Why did you come back? Why did you have to come back? Tears of pain and darkness. Rachel, you. <laughs> That's not. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tears of pain and darkness rolled down her eyes. What, what is tears of darkness? What, what, are they just... I don't know. That's what I paused are for. They, are they, black they are literally sure. black tears. That's her worst nightmare step towards her. You get to do this African line. American tears. What about pain? I am undefeatable, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you had your chance years and years ago, but you failed. Now I back to get you. What kind of voice changes... <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to fight me, father. She drew out her long bloody sword and looked at him in a cruel way. I haven't come to kill you right now, but someday I reckon. <laughs> I reckon. Uh, Beware. Uh, and with that, <laughs> he threw his sling blade, I mean smoke bomb, at her and disappeared. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold Continue, on. please. Hold on. Judge this seriously. So a 17-year-old... Four out of teenager, seven believes she can actually defeat her Point father, three. who's Nine, more six. experienced than her. Bro, she works for the mafia. The Yakuza. If this is like a vampire father, then fuck the Yakuza. She has a, she has a long bloody sword. She... Her breasts bounce delicately in, in the, the wind. wind. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> just like, does it get like a Godzilla scream? Like... <laughs> <laughs> Till next time, boss!